computer virus has built armies of robotic soldiers and taken control of our world. But there is still one place we can be safe. The domed city of Corinth. And the only hope we have left is... Ranger series operators. As you all know, I recently learned that my dear friends, Gem and Gemma, the original test operators of the Ranger program series hardware, survived the destruction of the Alphabet Soup research facility and escaped with the gold and silver series morphers, which they have been using to wage a brutal and merciless campaign against Vengex and the Wasteland. We like to shoot first and ask questions later. <laughs> humans need to live. Food? Water, maybe? Or, uh, no, television! Yeah, oh. I don't know why I bother trying to include you two at all. Oh. I was referring to air. Oh. Air? Oxygen, of uh. course! Ha <laughs> ha! That was my next guess! Gem and Gemma have confronted me with the possibility that in an effort to protect myself from future emotional trauma, I may have treated some of you with a degree of forced emotional detachment, perhaps even bordering on coldness. Bordering on coldness, you say? That's ridiculous, Doctor. You must be imagining it. No, no, I'm afraid it's true. My insistence on referring to each of you by your color series instead of by your real names is a perfect example. And so, as your mentor... Uh, mentor? How can you be our mentor? Aren't we all older than you? As your mentor, in an effort to make my feelings clear in an official capacity, I have the following announcement. Ranger Series Red. I greatly admire your honor, integrity, decision-making ability, and unusual hair. I feel lucky to have you as the leader of my team, Scott. Well, thank you, Doctor. Uh, what, what, what are you doing? Ranger Series Yellow. As the only other female in the group, I want you to know that my feelings of fondness for you are so strong, they override even my base biological instincts to undermine and sabotage you in an effort to monopolize the attention of the males. Thank you, Summer. Sure, Doctor. The feeling's mutual, I think. Uh, Ranger Series Blue. Your passion, optimism, and delightfully musical though often incomprehensible accent, of what make you the heart of the Rangers. Flynn. I'm happy to help out and win up. OK. And Ranger Series Black. <laughs> Even though you are clearly psychologically unstable and here against your will as part of a work release agreement, I still consider you a true hero, Dylan. You too, Ranger Series Green. You five are the only family I've ever known. I love you all very much. Well, that was certainly awkward. Can we please just pretend that didn't happen and go back to work now? Hey, hold on, what about me? What about all the nice things you wanted to say about me? We've got a shield breach. It's an inverse vector. Oxygen regeneration plan at gate 43. What about my real name? It's Ziggy. Zig E. Z I G G. Come on, Ranger. Operate a series green. It's playtime. <laughs> 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 That should 
be more than enough damage to do the trick. In your face, sister! Stop that! I said enough! We need to pull out before... Before the Rangers get here? Hmm. Sure. Something like that. Grinder! Uh, yeah, stretch that hammy, yeah. Uh-oh. Okay, now you see me? And now you do. Uh, 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 wait, wait! Move aside! Uh, oh, but that's it! Thanks! Recycled oxygen. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. What can I say? I'm just rotten to the core. <laughs> Rangers. Come on, we can still catch them. Rangers, the enemy's bugging out. Fall back to Gamma Perimeter. Roger that, Colonel. Understood. Jeff, uh, jump off! Uh, uh, Wait, we need to pull back and reinforce our defenses. But how can we defeat the enemy when the enemy is out there? <laughs> oh, uh, we stay within the dome, defend the city. That's the plan. But who says? I do. We've detected movement of massive Vengex troops and hardware outside the dome. Yes, so then we should go out there and... Kick some Vengex, but oh yeah! No! It's obvious that a major attack on the city is imminent. We need to divert all power to the shield. Seal out the enemy. Sure, that sounds... Like a super plan. Want to hear... Our plan? This outpost is three clicks from the main gate. We're gonna go out there and... Blow it up, God! Oh. Gee, you make it sound so easy. Hicks, give him the damage report. Yes, sir. The damage to the oxygen regeneration plant is extensive. We'll be living only on the air in the dome for the next 30 days until we can rebuild it. And that's why we can't afford to let it get hit again. That's why I'm going to charge up the dome shield beyond its current energy limits. Okay, good luck. With that, we've got a Vengex outpost. To blow up. 
Once I've overcharged the shield, I won't be able to lower it to let you two back in. Meh. Dad, maybe they have a point. Maybe if we start launching some offensive attacks, then we can... And put the last human city left on this Earth at risk? What are you two trying to do exactly? We're trying to win. Why? What are you trying? To do, Colonel? <laughs> Excellent. The foolish humans appear to be preparing to overload the charge on the city shield as we speak. Once the shields are powered up to that level, it will be hours before they can lower them again. And by that time, it will be too late. My vacuum bot will have sucked all the air out of the city, with everyone trapped inside, unable to lower their own shields to escape. Because I wanted to make sure you didn't have any more announcements you wanted to make. No, Ranger Series Green. Well, maybe something of a more personal nature. Maybe something or, or someone you, uh, you forgot to mention. Uh, no, I don't think so. Well, probably because you had really deep feelings about it, uh, or him, uh, and that would make it harder for you to express. Uh, Scott, Summer. Hey, Doc, come check this out. Now, here's the movement of the Vengex troops we've been tracking, and down here's the outpost that Gem and Gemma went to hit. Now, what's this line running from here to here under the city? It's a prehistoric underground riverbed. It only shows up on the geological survey maps. Well, Vengex could never get troops into the city through there. Wait, what if he's not trying to get troops in? What if they're trying to take something out? What's the reading, Higgs? We just need to expel half a percentage more nitrogen and then air levels will be optimal. Okay, prepare to seal all gates and surge all available power supplies toward the shield. I am by regulation dictated to remind the Colonel, sir, that overcharging the shields will mean losing the ability to raise or lower the city shield for several hours, sir. Dad! Dad! Wait, stop, wait, you can't do this. Not now, son. No, 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 you don't understand. Benjax wants us to panic and overcharge the shield. Sir, we're losing optimal air. Seal all gates, overcharge the shield. Seal all gates, overcharge the shield. Repeat, overcharging of shield has been authorized. Oxygen approaching critical level. Dad, listen to me. Jem and Gemma were right. We can't just hide in here. Son, you know the plan. Yeah, I know the plan. This time I ain't just following you. Let's go! Scott! Hits, get this thing over! Sir, it won't matter. Scott! Sir! The shields are overcharged. We won't be able to lower them for at least a few hours. I'm afraid he's trapped out there, sir. We're trapped in here. What do you suppose? It is. Hey, maybe I can shine some light on that. Scott! So glad you could make it. Why the change? I'm hard. New information. Vengex is planning to suck the oxygen supply out of the city. From there. That would explain. The two. Look, we need to split up. Jem, you distract the grinders. Gemma, you come with me. Oh, no, we don't ever split up. It's the first time for everything. <laughs> Watch it. Get moving, you lazy machine! That means now! Here it goes. back on the shield power. Sir, there's no way. Colonel, I'm showing oxygen levels beginning to drop in the dome's upper atmosphere. Scott was right. So we're Gem and Gemma. We have to get out there and help them stop Vengex now. It'll be hours before I can pull enough energy away from the grid to lower the shields. We don't have hours, Colonel. 
There's no way out. No, there's one way. Station 19, remember, Dylan? Uh, it, it, advanced propane gas, even when the shields are up. I thought that was only at dawn. But we can reset the city's atomic clock. Reset it all for dawn. Let's do it. There's only one problem. With the shields overcharged, the flame bursts will be firing at a rate 200 times faster than normal. Then we have to be very careful. Plan to triangulate our fire, then we then can. It's boom what? time! No. <laughs> Gemma, wait! The pressure is too high! <laughs> Gemma! This is it. It's the only way out. Why would you just call me by my first name? We've got to go through. We've got no choice. Good. Then we can stop talking and get to it. I, I mean, Ziggy, is that so hard? Would you get your head in the game, man? Ready? Ready! RPM! Get in gear! Look out! Ready? Yeah! Street Saber! Initiating Chi Energy Burst. Roger, Ranger Yellow. Be careful to conserve energy flow. Energy blast! Initiating 10 second time freeze! <laughs> Invincibility shield! Okay, Ranger Series Green, who also answers to the name Ziggy, is initiating his teleport thing. Hey! I made it! We all made it! And this was all my idea, so, so maybe some kind words are in order from our self-proclaimed mentor. Maybe, nice job, Ziggy, or, or how about, so glad you're on the team, Ziggy. Uh, Ranger Series Green, I suggest you move to another location immediately. Oh, no. See, I'm not moving anywhere until you call me by my real name, Ziggy. Come on! I mean, seriously, am I asking too much? Suck on this! Too soon. Let's end this sucker! Back to the junkyard! Engine self activate! Combine weapons! Light! And loaded! Fire! Begin the download now! Down morphing your swords. 
the dome. <laughs> In an effort to improve my role as your mentor... Uh, uh, mentor. Sorry. Can someone please explain to her that she's younger than us? I want to begin adding positive reinforcement to our post-mission debriefings. Scott, as usual, your judgment and leadership were impeccable. Summer, you served admirably as leader in Scott's brief absence, and uh, I love those shoes. Flynn, Excellent work, as always. Dylan, you showed amazing courage. Gem, Gemma, you guys have made me proud. And you. Uh... Uh, no, uh, no. Hey, wait, you weren't finished. Sector 27. Come on, this could be the last time you ever see me. 